Shot X here from NTP, and I am back again with another Hermitcraft member. Today we have Corellis. This is actually a pretty big YouTuber. Um, so yeah, I actually know him quite a bit. Epic actually uh, used to watch him a long time ago, one of our own members. Epic, she used to watch him a lot uh, back in the day when she first got into Minecraft. So, you know, one of our members watching this guy. I haven't watched him much, but I know about him. Uh, but yeah, if you want to check out his uh, channel, you know, link to it in the description, as well as a link to the original video in which we made all of these guys, this whole uh, group. We're starting the first row now. Check it out. We're almost done. Look at that. We've gotten through three rows so far. I mean, it's been a long journey. <laughs> We're finally here. The final row, the final six, starting off with Corallis. So, uh, yes, yeah, so let's go ahead and jump into the dimensions and stuff here so this doesn't take very long at all. Because he's not a very hard skin. So, uh, yes, yeah, so, legs here are 8 by 4 by 12. The torso here is 8 by 4 by 12. The arms they are attached or aligned to the torso and they are 4 by 4 by 12. The head here is 8 by 8 by 8 with no head effect whatsoever on any side. Uh, and those dimensions are linked by width by height. So, yes. Important note to make here as well is uh, this is literally just a screaming Steve. If you know how to make a Steve skin like this guy right here, like Joe Hill, you know, it's just a Steve skin with the at sign. Then, uh, yeah, you can pretty much make both these guys. Like, if you know how to make a Steve, you can make Joe Hill and you can make Corrales, like, nothing. Because they're just, like, a little bit different from a normal Steve. But, um, yeah, even, st even still, if you don't know how to make a, uh, make a Steve, I guess we'll, uh, run through the basics. So, pretty much it's, you know, everything except the face is a Steve, <laughs> you know. But, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll still get into this. Oh, and of course, at the very end, I'll have pictures in the plastic texture pack. Because I will kind of burn through this a little quickly, because it is a very, fairly simple skin, you know, that a lot of people should be able to make if you make statues, at least fairly often. Making Steve's is just kind of like a default, you know, every person who makes a lot of statues, you know how to do this, so. Making Corrala should be a breeze for just about anyone. But, if you've never made a whole bunch of these before, then, you know, we're still going to go through this step by step. So, just like we always do. So, here's the front of the legs. Uh, the front of the legs is just two layers of stone, and then ten layers of blue. Like, that simple. Just two layers of stone, ten layers of blue. For the shoes and the pants. And come around here to the side, you can see that pretty much all of this just wraps around. You have those, you know, this side of the, you have two side, uh, two layers of, uh, stone, and then ten layers of blue. Except when you get to here at the back, where it's three layers of stone, and, uh, nine layers of blue. So that is the only difference. We have three layers here of stone, and then it goes up to nine, to the very top, where, uh, you know, top of the pants here. And this side of the pants is the exact same as the other side, so just uh, mirror that right across, just reflect it, and there you go. Here is the front of the torso. It's just the pants and the shirt. So, pants are blue, uh, shirt is cyan, and then the uh, skin is just uh, regular oak wooden planks. So, there you go. There is, uh, that. So, um, and here's the side of the arm. All these things, they just, uh, wrap around, as you can see here. That all just wraps around. Right? All this wraps around. Uh, both arms are exactly the same. I'll go ahead and show that real fast. How all these colors, the Oakland planks and cyan, it all just kind of wraps around. You know? That's it. Get to the back here. It's just this little thing on the bottom, and then you just fill the whole torso in practically with uh, cyan. Also, if you want to know the exact number for how many oak wooden planks and how many uh, cyan, it's uh, four cyan up there at the shoulder, and then it's eight uh, oak wooden planks. So you can just, you know, I guess picture that in your head. And then right here, it's just the blue and the cyan for the pants and the shirt meeting. And uh, there you go. And then as for the face, obviously his face is different from a regular Steve because he's screaming. And, uh, so, his mouth, you know, it's wide open, it's black, and then, uh, tongue is red, the eyes are all white, and then, uh, black on the inside, and then the hair's brown, and then the, uh, the skin is oak wood planks. So there's that. Come right here to the side, it's just, uh, oak wood planks for the skin, and then the hair is just brown. So, simple as that. 
then showing the back here it's not really much to show it's just you know both sides kind of come in right there on the back and then you know, I just fill literally the rest of it with brown and then this side is uh, pretty much the same as this side in fact it's not pretty much it is it's the exact same as the other side so just mirror it right across because both sides are exactly the same so there you go Oakland planks of brown and then you just fill in the top of the brown, and then you're done with uh, Kralis. See, he wasn't that hard. He's not that. He's not that crazy. Not like Monkey Farm over there, the evil thing. You know, <laughs> this guy. He's not as bad. He's definitely not as bad. So shouldn't be as intimidated by him. Yeah, he's a little hard, but you know, don't think too much of him. You know, he's not that bad. So, but um, yep, that's pretty much it. If you guys have any requests, go and leave them in the comments. This could be anything from other YouTubers to any custom things that we do here on the channel and other hermit crafters, you know, that maybe we've missed or something, so, uh, that we haven't made in this group. So, um, yeah, go ahead and let us know all that. And that's it. So thank you guys for watching. As always, I will see you for the next one.